Hey, it's Ayla. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. But yeah, so today I'm coming to you guys with an unpopular opinions video about my school. So a lot of people might like not understand half the things I'm saying. And like if you haven't been to Clark Atlanta University and you haven't like experienced half the things I've experienced, like a lot of this won't make sense to you. But I mean, it's like some of them are like general ideas about school and stuff. So I just do recommend you guys watch it anyways. So let's get started. Okay, so I would do that little disclaimer thing, but I'm pretty sure you guys have heard that a bunch of times. So I have some unpopular opinions that I have wrote um, and then some that like some of my friends gave me that they wanted me to just say. So this is unpopular opinions that are in a whole like just unpopular <laughs> so the first one that i have is the cat food now everybody says like the cat food is like not good but me a person who like never got home like home cooked meals and stuff because my mom hated cooking and i hate cooking and everybody hated cooking so i enjoy it honestly and sometimes yeah like the food isn't like great but you need to know how to like mix up some combinations combine some things together and make it good because i promise you like you can make something out of nothing with that cat food thank you <laughs> next one is the dorms traditional dorms in like a whole i would say for like a freshman incoming freshman which is what i am it always is ideal to like i don't know like be around your class so i would say traditional dorms are like better in that sense because like you're with your whole freshman class and like it's easier and i feel like there's more like i don't know talking there like if you talk to people it's more of like a sisterhood in there and then you have the suites which is where i live and it's a bunch of people like mixed together there's like sophomores juniors a bunch of just like people that live here and there's not like a full like freshman area so you know like you don't really get to be around your like freshman class that's like the only downside to it but obviously my opinion is contradicting but i would say that um it is more ideal to live here though in a sense because in the suites you have more room so you just have to choose between like do i want room or do i want friends i want room <laughs> yeah so my opinion basically is that like for an incoming freshman i think it's better that you stay in the traditionals but i live in the suites so Okay, the next one is morning classes compared to night classes. In my opinion, I feel like I would rather have morning classes to get it all over with in the day than like having classes like at night because like you finish your class, you get to go like back to your room, take a nap, and you still have time for like homework or whatever you want to do. Because me, I have like mainly like afternoon classes, not like night classes, but you know what I mean, like afternoon classes. So like I get to wake up like a little later but then like I'm sitting all day like waiting to go to class instead of just like being free you know so I would I prefer like a morning class over like night classes okay so the next one is getting out of class early and I don't know about you guys but I don't like to get out of class early like my mom and like everyone in my family me included busted their butts for me to get to the school and um teachers just want to let me out of class early when i haven't learned a single thing so i in my opinion do not like getting out of class early because that's just like you like throwing my money out the door like oh you don't care but, i mean it is nice sometimes but like sis this tuition and me getting out of class early are not adding up next is like a big topic that I feel like everybody at Clark might agree on so it's not really unpopular but like for people who've never who don't go to the school and just have heard of like the AUC unity type thing mm -mm, not a thing I feel like it's more of like Spelman and Morehouse all girls all boys let's just stick together and Clark doesn't get like any type of recognition from that like I feel like that's all like just like a saying like oh AUC no <laughs> there's always like certain events that are like spell house events not like AUC events so like there's like I think it was a modeling show or something out here and it was for spell house which I mean we have modeling shows over here but like you have to go to Spellman or Morehouse to be in that modeling show and I feel like with us at Clark we include we're really good at like including everyone but them over there like 
you're like oh clark that's cute so in my opinion there is no aec unity unless you're going to a party and then you'll see like spellman and warehouse and, or olive branch but yeah next one is visitation there shouldn't be no like there shouldn't be like I mean, I understand the rules of visitation, but there shouldn't be like, we get no visitation for the first like couple of months of school. Like, I feel like that's dumb because for the first couple of months of school, I've paid my rent to live here and I've paid to get be in my room and stuff like that. So if I want to have visitors, I, w I should be able to have visitors. Like, I feel like the visitation rule, it's like, I see where you're going with that, but for the first three months of school like sis that's when i'm just making friends i want them to see my room the visitation rule is not cute the last one that i have are the food trucks this is one that a friend gave to me and i actually personally have never had the food trucks but i there's probably a reason why i've never gone to them and that's just because they don't look good i feel like that's just another thing for students to like spend their money on that that's not very necessary but there are food trucks that do come on campus. There's like catfish truck and like some other truck. I don't know what that is. They're like not all that they seem to be. Apparently she said they're overrated. And I feel like it is. This is like another thing that students like have to pay for or use their flex dollars. Which could be used to like, I don't know, Moe's. Which is probably, in my opinion, better than any food truck they could have had out here. Or like Dunkin' Donuts in the morning when you're like going to class. Like... These food trucks are snatching up our money. That's another opinion that, and this is like the last one I have, I promise. But another opinion that I have is like, why is there like certain things out here that you have to pay for knowing that we're all students? We've already paid our tuition. Like, what else do you want from us? Like, why do you need more money from me? Like, I paid my tuition. I've like, <laughs> like for freshmen, there's certain events that like we attend and like you have to wear certain things for that. Like, I did not bring, for induction, I did not bring a white dress <laughs> i don't have a white dress that's knee length and appropriate for a nice school event and i had to go out and buy one like i literally just got here i paid much like i paid come here i don't have to pay for anything more you know what i mean so yeah those are all the pins that i have i'm probably gonna think of more as my school life goes on thank you guys so 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 much for watching this video to the end if you like it make sure you give a like comment and subscribe and also want to just give you guys a big thank you for 5,000 plus subscribers that's literally insane we're half to 10 10 half to 10,000 I'm super excited about that like this really like motivates me like crazy to just go hard so that's what I'm planning to do but yeah bye